guys, welcome back to my channel. So tonight I just wanted to film this video to show you guys what happened <laughs> to my face um, after I used this product. So the other day I filmed a Get Ready With Me and I used this mask, um, the Clinical Skincare Hunter Hungarian Thermal Water from Peter Thomas Roth, this guy here. So I actually used this product before in the past. I used it about like two times. Um, and the directions to say that you're only supposed to leave it on for about a minute to two minutes. And I wanted up leaving it on my skin for about 10 to 15 minutes while I got ready to get in the shower. So what that meant was it kind of penetrated my skin pretty deeply. But now I'm just sitting here like. The number you have dialed has been changed. The new number is. So the mask left my skin in pretty bad condition. So it broke me out um, and I'm never gonna use this product again. This is trash um, and that's pretty much it. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna show you guys basically what I do when my skin's a bit irritated and how do I fix it. But first I'm just gonna get up close and show you guys what that product actually did to my skin. So the mask left my skin with a bit of texture, especially when I smell. Um, and right now my skin just feels super dry um, and taut. There's a pimple coming in here, so I know it definitely broke me out. And this all happened in the course of today. I know that no other products that I used did that to me because I've always used them. And the mask is something that I don't really incorporate into my routine, but I'm a big fan of Peter Thomas Roth, but this mask really did me in, man. Got my skin looking all crazy. That mask got me really here like. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time. I'm just like really, I'm, I'm tight, like, so. Now what I'm going to do is wash my face. Um, I have to keep it really minimal in terms of the products that I use now because I don't want my skin to get any more stressed out. So I'm probably just going to use like a calming serum after I wash my face and that's all. And I will be right back to show you guys what I use. But my skin's pretty irritated. I pretty much just use this one cleanser. It's called the Pure Skin face cleanser from First Aid Beauty. I don't know if you can see it because the light's pretty bright. But yeah, this cleanser is really calming um, and it's really good for sensitive skin. I don't have sensitive skin, but my skin does get sensitized at certain times of the year. So what I do is just wet my face and then just go in with this guy and I'll be right back. So I just add a bit of the cleanser into my hands and then just go in like I would any other cleanser. So you see like the lather on this one is really gentle. It's gonna help remove that grime from throughout the day. Um, but what I like about this one is not fragrant. It doesn't have a scent. The other cleanser that I use doesn't have a scent either, like the Good Morning pH cleanser, but it does have tea tree oil. And I don't wanna put that on my skin right now cause that oil tends to be a bit like powerful. So I'm not going to put that on right now because I don't want it to upset my skin anymore. Even though that cleanser is gentle as well. Alright. So now I'm just going to rinse this off and I will be right back to show you what I use when my skin's super irritated and just upset. Alright. So now I'm just going to dry off and then I'm going to go in with my serum. So this is modulating glucosides. So this is basically going to help calm my skin down, tame everything, and just keep me nice and relaxed. So this is a blend of like glucose and like yeast actives that just help keep the skin calm. It has like Tasmanian pepperberry, which is going to help calm the skin on contact. And this is like one of my favorite products when <laughs> I tend to just do too much shit to my skin. Um, 
and it just brings it all back down. This is from Neod, and Neod is a branch of Decium. And again, Neod just stands for Non-Invasial Options in Dermal Sciences. So this is designed to kind of go down into the second layer of the skin and just really help repair any kind of damage, redness, and just visible irritation. Um, and you can see that my skin looks like visibly irritated. So this is gonna help calm that down. And I'm not gonna put anything else on my skin. I'm probably just gonna put like some salicylic acid right here on this little spot that's flaring up um, from the irritation as well. But yeah, I'm just gonna keep it calm. Thank you for watching, guys.